preparations for other investors are already here. Kongamano hilo linaweka kwa hamasisha na kutoa nafasi zitakazowezesha wahusika kutoa mafunzo ambayo watapata kwa serikali zao na sekta za kibinafsi ili kuhakikisha kwa ugonjwa huo unabainika mapema na kutibiwa kwa haraka. Kulingana na msemaji wa ya Rais Manuel Sipisu, alithibitisha kuwa kongamano hilo litaongozwa na mke Rais Margaret Kenyatta. Kongamano hilo linanabatana na juhudi za mamlaka taifa za kuhakikisha kuwa afya ya Kenya na hata ulimwengu mzima unaimarika. The conference will raise awareness and provide opportunities for advocacy for what is a most important subject amongst many of us and certainly in all walks of life. The conference also enables participants to share lessons learned as well as to mobilize both corporate and political resources and goodwill as part of the quest to get governments and the private sector to partner in ensuring early detection and treatment of cancer. Kongamano hilo hufanyika kila mwaka katika nchi mbalimbali barani Afrika kutokana na juhudi za wake wa marais wa nchi hizo. Kando na wake wa marais, kongamano hilo litawaleta pamoja wabunge, mawaziri wa afya, wataalamu wa afya, wanasayansi miongoni mwa washikada wengine. As part of the activities around the conference, uh, the office of the first lady of our republic has set up a free cancer screening area at the KICC which is to op which is open to the public every day from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. until the 21st of July this year. That's mid next week. Inakaridiwa kwa ugonjwa wa saratani huwaua zaidi ya watu milioni nane kote duniani kila mwaka ambayo ni asilimia 13 ya idadi ya vifo kote duniani. Takriban asilimia sabini ya vifo vinavyosababishwa na ugonjwa wa saratani hutokea katika nchi zenye mapato ya chini ambazo nyingiazo ni za bara la Afrika. Humu nchini ugonjwa saratani unaorodheshwa nambari tatu ambayo ni asilimia saba ya idadi ya vifo kote nchini kila mwaka. Helix Odhiambo, Machuwe Weekend.